I'm world famous animator John Schnall and today I am going to teach you how to have amazing zoom backgrounds. Uh, you may think this is not much of a background actually it's uh, just you know I'm in a basement studio and there's a wall right behind me and stuff but I have to tell you if you're in a zoom meeting we've all been in zoom meetings a long time and they can get kind of tedious anything you can do to stand out and lighten the mood will be appreciated by your fellow comrades in Zoom world. So I want to teach you how to do your own backgrounds to stand out and out from the crowd and make life a little more interesting. It could be backgrounds like uh, like this or 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 even like this. Hmm. Gotta get that fixed. So if you want to liven up your meetings with fun backgrounds, it's an easy process. The first step, unfortunately, is to be an animator. Uh, if you're not an animator, I'm not going to teach you how to animate things like this skeleton over here. Sorry, that's for that's that's a little more advanced. But if you know how to do some basic animation, I will teach you how to put it into your Zoom backgrounds. And if you don't know anything about animation, at the end of the lesson, I'll teach you how to do something that'll be a lot of fun, no skill required. You can liven up your meetings in the same kind of way. So let's get started. The first thing you need if you want to have this sort of background is to take a photo of your own background. This background behind me right now, as you can tell by the way my hand's disappearing, is actually a Zoom background. My actual background is completely different. This is the actual live background. So what I did was I simply stepped out of the picture and took a photograph of my background, just a screenshot. And then once you have a photo of your background, whatever you put over that is going to look really fun and cool. If you just take the photo and like, if you just go in Photoshop and try to manipulate stuff, that alone makes an interesting background. But of course, we want to incorporate motion. So you can use that photograph of your background as a background for animation. You just put it in as the bottom layer, animate over it, export it as a movie, and then you have an animated background. And once you have that animated background, we go into our preferences in Zoom, we go into our backgrounds and filters preference and you can upload by using this plus button you can upload a video and that will be behind you simple couldn't be easier now let's say you want to get creative with this let's say you're, you want to be able to disappear from a boring meeting you know meaning that you just want people to think you're still there but uh, it's kind of tedious so uh, what I do is I have created a perfect duplication of myself which just goes on a video in the background and then I can go away and do whatever it is I want to do while my uh, doppelganger is there just carrying on the meeting and no one would ever notice well okay sometimes people notice but still as to what you animate, well, that's entirely up to you. You could come up with something completely zany. And actually, I'd love to see what you come up with. So if you try this, please record yourself in Zoom and uh, put a link in the comments in whatever you're watching this in. I don't know where I'm going to post it, frankly. Okay, I promise that for people that are not animators, I would show you something you could do right now that would uh, give you tons of fun in a Zoom meeting. And true to my word, here we go. What you can do is you know how to record yourself in Zoom, right? Or record your Zoom meeting. You simply, you know, hit record. You know how to do that. So uh, what you can do is record your own zany background. Wait, I'm going to go over here. Get this chair out of it. And I'm going to record. Here, let me hit record. Recording in progress. Okay, now I'm going to stop the recording. Recording stopped. And then after you finish your meeting, you find that uh, recording. It'll generally be in your documents folder. There's a Zoom folder and a bunch of dates and... Uh, Oh, look, there it is. And now in Zoom, 
in my preferences, let's open preferences again, backgrounds and filters. Okay, you see the plus sign, add video. We will uh, navigate to our documents folder, zoom, today's date, and there it is. We open it up. Okay, and now as you see, without any animation skill whatsoever, you could have a fun little uh, scene going on behind you during your Zoom call to annoy your friends. Okay, I hope you found this lesson useful. Oh, there's me. What do you know? I hope you found this. Ah! <laughs> okay, I hope you found this lesson useful and um, look forward to hearing your comments and seeing your own attempts at making a Zoom background. Bye bye.